Right then, hiya folks. Hope you're all well. Welcome to another video. We're uh, back over on All British Casino for today's one. This is going to be the £50 tournament giveaway that everyone got involved in on Tuesday's video. Just want to say a big thank you to everyone that got involved. Um, it's going to be the last one before Christmas. It may possibly be the last video before Christmas. Now I'm going to take a bit of a break and uh, spend some time with the family over Christmas and celebrate as best we can this year. Um, I know Boris put a dampener on a lot of our... Uh, a lot of our plans yesterday, but um, yeah, it is what it is for this year, and it. I think we can uh, manage to struggle through. I hope everyone, uh, hope everyone has a decent Christmas, anyhow. And um, yeah, if I don't see you before, make sure you do, and I will catch you in the new year, obviously, on some more videos. But um, like I say, this is the last giveaway before Christmas, and then I will do a lot more in the new year. Um, I've got the YouTube random comment picker thingy majuggy set up so we're going to pick the eight names straight away is the first one. <coughs> oh, excuse me first one is ricky morley ricky morley okay name number two is craig hickton craig hickton number three Is Conrad two six four? Conrad two six four. Number four. Number four is Melissa Lennox. Melissa Lennox. Name number five. Number five is S. Oris. Okay, on to the sixth one. Sixth one is Fighter Jet 590 Ryan. Okay, just got to jot that down. That's a bit of a long name. I'm just going to call you 590 Ryan if you don't mind in the tournament. So I don't think I'll fit that on my table. Um, number seven. Number seven is Dean Winchester. Dean Winchester. And the last one to be drawn, good luck everyone, is Jackie Hurd. Okay, right, so there is the eight people involved in this one. I'd say a big thank you to everyone that got involved, appreciate it. Um, I know people do enjoy these ones, so yeah, but I will keep them coming. Um, we've got the wheeler names here, with all the providers in, so we're going to draw the first one for Ricky Morley. Ricky Morley has got Thunder Kick. Just about. Thunder Kick. Okay, remove that. Craig Hickton. Micro Gaming. Okay, this one's for Comrade264. You've got SG. Right, this one's for Melissa Le Melissa Lennox. That's a mouthful for me. <laughs> Melissa Lennox. It is Blueprint. Blueprint. Okay, S. Oris now. That is going to be Neten. Right, this is for Fighter Jet 590 Ryan. You've got Big Time Gaming. Okay, next one is Dean Winchester. It's either Play and Go or Inspired. It is Play and Go. So then the last one, which is Inspired, goes to Jackie Hurd. Right, I will just set up the table quickly now, and then we'll get going. Everything's set up, so yeah, we'll uh, get cracking straight away. As you can see, all the matchups there. Ricky Morley with Thunderkick against Craig Hickton in the first round. 
So we're uh, going to hit up a thunder kick. I'll probably play between 50 and 60p stakes on this one. It is worked out on the X amount of win that the bonus goes for. So, um, yeah, we get cracking. Okay, then, here we go. First up, Sword of Khans for thunder kick. It's on a 50p stake. Hasn't took much at all. Okay, seven spins. Not the best amount, but... Not the best symbol either, Queens, but if we go... Here we go, should I say? If we go, here we go. It'd be really nice to see a re-trigger off this one. Not seen one for a while. Come on, sword. Okay, there's a four. Pop swings along a bit. Tenor for four. Go on. Oh, I thought it was going to do a full screen. It's another tenor though. Puts the bonus up to 29. Come on, do it. Queen or sword. Uh, at least he put a queen in. Another tenor. To 3950 3925 rather it's trying <laughs> it just doesn't want to do it does it there we go 3925 on a 50p stake for sword of cards that's not bad at all really okay we'll move on to Craig Hickton with micro gaming to see whether he can beat that we're in on Terminator 2. Here we go. The trigger was 360. Got to beat. This is on a 60p stake, this one. Got to beat 39.25 on a 50p stake, which I haven't worked out yet, which I'm probably sure you can do. To 840. Five spins to go after this one. You need to know how Skynet gets built. It's creeping up and not fast enough, I don't think. We need something big to land. It's cost a fair bit to get as well, about 57 quid. It's not paying a great deal, is it? Okay, there we go, it's gone for 17.22. 17.22 on a 60p. Okay, I'll bring up, bring up the table and uh, Mind you, I say it costs that much. It's cost more than that because that has been adding the adding the bonus amount on as it goes. I think I started playing this at 5.30. So, uh, yeah, right. I'll bring up the table anyway and we'll see who's gone through. Okay, then, folks, there we go. Ricky Morley going through from that one. Um, 78X from Sword of Khans and uh, Terminator 2, unfortunately, for Craig. Just didn't really perform at all. 28X. So, uh, yeah, we'll move on to the next first round match now, which is Comrade264 with uh, Scientific Games against Melissa Lennox with Blueprint. Okay, we're in for SG. This is Gremlins. This is for Comrade. Let's hope we get a decent one. Over stops. Yeah, I didn't want that one at all. This is the... Uh, X amount of win you're gonna get here. Spin. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the worst one. Moving seven. 
Okay, 20x. Is that it normally only spins once from my experience? Um, yeah, 12 pound, 20x there. Okay, you are up against blueprint though, so uh, yeah, we could uh, obviously get a bottom bonus on a blueprint and it can do exactly the same, so we will go and take a look. Got to count up the win. Takes the balance back up to 481. That did bonus nice and quick. So, um, yeah. Okay, we'll move on to Blueprint. And on Ted, this is for Melissa. All right, so that's what we'll do and you've got to be 20x. Gonna have to take what it gives me. Oh, oh yeah. it is the bottom oh, one. Yeah. Got to collect. I can't even remember playing this one. I'll tell you what I got. Okay. Pick a symbol. Nice. Not the player boost. Are we still gonna smoke that pot? It's actually pretty mellow. Are we ever gonna get a spin? Do you want a spin or does it only give you one spin when you land a spin? Good, eh? Nice. Okay, we're just getting multiplier boost. Nice. It's actually pretty mellow. <laughs> hey, look, that was a tough okay, here we go. Guess we need an arrow. Twenty-one X, is that it? Because if it is, you beat Comrade oh, by one X. Wow. It is twelve sixty was actually up on the game when I got the bonus so okay you've beat uh yeah you've beat comrade there by one x sorry comrade that's the way it goes I'm afraid um okay I'll bring up the table just to confirm Melissa just scraping through there by one x over comrade with uh what was it we played for comrade um gremlins wasn't it yeah Ted just pipping at that so we've got Ricky Morley and Thunder Kick against Melissa Lennox and blueprint in the first semi-final next up we're moving to the second round uh the third first round match should i say um s oris with netent against uh 590 ryan with big time gaming hey guys i'll just bring you back here because i am on this rage of seas again and i've got all the things open okay, it's see. not actually the bonus but um if things go well this could change my balance by quite a bit so yeah here we go spins and another two just need to see some of these stat wilds there's a big win 11.52 not that big and there's another big one Another 1152. Okay. 12.96. Need to get some of these premiums all the way across. Ooh, that was close. There's a lot of barrels there though. Wow, 92 pound. another two spins this one can certainly pay if you get all three of these open that was unlucky not really had any premiums across not going to but that's 147 quid puts the balance up to 646 just thought i'd show you that because yeah the balance was going to change quite a bit i will continue to try and get the bonus uh for s oris but um yeah if not on this it will obviously be on another net end game Bonus for Netent. This is Piggy Riches. I'm going to go for... I normally go for the middle one. I'm going to go for the middle one. 15 spins. And a 3x multiplier. So off we go. Siren going past. You get a free spin for every scatter you get. Need to 
see some wins, please. Right, that's five spins down. That's the first win. It was a trigger of four quid. Come on, game. Another spin. A 260p win so far. Doing absolutely nothing. Okay, there's another three spins. Should be a full retrigger, really, but yeah, it's not. We're up to a tenner. This is not great. Another spin. All right, there we go. Yeah, it's gone for ten pounds sixty on a sixty p stake. We move across to BTG now to see whether it can beat that. We're in on danger for big time gaming. This is for Fighter Jet Five Ninety Ryan. We're gonna go high voltage. We've got to beat seventeen x. Don't get on the gates, so that's why I chose this side. We've got skulls out. Ooh. All right, I think that's just beat it. See, that only went up to 11x, though. That's cost a fair bit, this bonus. I started playing around 600 and something on the balance. New trigger will be lovely. Not had a retrig on this for a while. Need to see this multiplier. Okay, we're out with nines. It's only gone to times eleven again. Three to go. Come on, multiplier, where are you? Yeah, it's a poor one. I think it's just seen you through though, Ryan. Okay, 13.17 on a 60p stake. We should balance back up to 5.59. Ryan, I shall pull up the table. Okay, there we go then. Just confirmation that Ryan went through with Big Time Gaming and um, Danger 21x just pipping S Oris there with Neten. Um, but we'll move on to the next one to see who meets Ryan in the semi final. It is Dean Winchester and Playing Go against Jackie Hurd with Inspired. Legacy are dead for Playing Go. It's quite a nice trigger as well. Full line of aces there. It's on a 50p state this one. Right, we've got Mr. Doghead. Here we go. I just want to re-trigger. Very rarely see it out of this game. Okay, not one expansion yet. All the halfway through. The first one. These two. Come on, do something. Surprise me for once. Do it. Okay, it has. Nice to see. Just need some wins now, though. Okay, we've got two premiums. Just need to see them. Number two of that fell up. Another retrigger would be lovely. None of these symbols are showing up, are they? Come on, do it. Oh, it's just gone past. Come 
There's another two. Down to the last spin. Yeah, that's really bad and it's just crashed on me. Okay, let me just load it back up quick. See what the uh, final amount was. It wasn't very much though. Nice of it to just crash on the end. There we go. Show us that last spin again. How much is that? That is £18.50. Wow. Retriggered bonus. £18.50 on a 50p stake. Collect that. Takes the balance to 538. Still a little bit of profit. Moving on to Inspired Gaming now to see whether it can beat that. Okay, folks, this is Elemental Beasts for Inspired. Got six free spends. Got to be 37x from Play and Go. Can't really remember how this one works. I'm guessing we need to collect these. They're going down there. Okay, we've got them all to the end, but I'm not quite sure what that does. Is that all it does? Gives you a times two. Yeah, that's the first win. Wow, is that it? Okay, spin insurance. We've got an extra three spins. Because our win was so shit. <laughs> I need a couple more of these wolves on the last spin. That's what they are. Okay, there they are. Does that give us some more spins now? As we got to that end? Hoping so. Three spins. No, that is it, really. Wow. What a shit game. Okay, that's gone for £8.40 on a 60p stake, unfortunately. Right, so we'll pull up the table. That's all the first round matches complete. There we go then. The uh, first round match is all done. Dean Winchester going through there with play and go. Um, Legacy of Dead, 37x. And then Jackie. Elemental Beasts was a load of ru rubbish, unfortunately. Apologies there. Can't remember. I, I think I played that game once before, but it was a long time ago. But um, yeah, apologies for that one. Um, right, we've got our semi final lineups all complete. We've got Ricky Morley and Thunderkick against Melissa Lennox and Blueprint. And then we've got 590 Ryan, Big Time Gaming, against Dean Winchester and Play and Go. Thunderkick, Wild Heist at Peacock Manor. This is for Ricky Morley. It's on a 50p stake. Got a pick three. I'm going to go that end. I'm going to start shaking for the gold card. I'm going to go that end. Okay, we've got the gold card. Walking wild, which is nice. I'm going to go there. Okay, we've got a wild blue, a wild purple, and a walking wild. Here we go. Could be alright as long as this walking wild shows up. We'll see, another key would be lovely. Okay, we've got another pick. Another key. Right, some spins now would be nice. Okay, another two spins. Shame, it's the lowest, but okay, we'll take it. Hey, okay, wild line. Ooh, close. Need that walking wild over that side. Go on. Okay, that's a nice win. It's a big win. 9.45, not that big. Another key. Do it. Just need this wild to keep showing up. Like that. One loads of room for a key. Trying to give me it. Okay, 
Wow. Okay, at least we got a walking wild in. Wow, come on then. Uh, one up. A big win. Another 865. Take the bonus to 3280. There should be wilds everywhere. Another walking wild. And it's just there. You can see the top bottom of it. Doesn't want to put that key in, does it? Fifty-eight quid, though. The world's out again. I've got two of them. Okay, that's a nice win. Another thirteen pound up to seventy six. Go on, go on. It's on the end. Getting it on the end. Another ten up. Right, this is the last spin potentially. Okay, 250 on the end. That's a very nice bonus though. It's gone for £88.50 on a 50p stake. Okay, 88.55 that went for in total. Right, let's set the balance up to 575, so 75 in profit. Um, we're moving on to Blueprint now. That is for Melissa. This is Genie Jackpot's Wishmaker. Got a bit to do, um, Melissa. You gotta beat 177x. It's probably gonna be a bit of a big ask. Unless you get up to the top. I'm gonna have to take what it gives me though, I'm afraid. It's Lucky Wishes cash spins. Okay. It's on a 60p stake this one. Right, here we go. Anyone, anything was going to land then, but you get three spins, don't you? Each time. Right, need something to land now, desperately. Okay, £18. Yeah, I think you're going to need to fill the screen here. And then get a bit of help afterwards as well because you get to pick some different feature afterwards I think whether it times it by two etc or something like that well, it's not doing too bad I haven't got a clue how much that is but yeah it's probably close to around 30 quid Need something to land now. No, unfortunately, can't do it. How much has that gone for in total? I said it was close to 30 quid. It is bang on 30 quid. I should have just said 30 quid, shouldn't I? I'm pretending my maths is really good. Okay, there we go then. I'll bring up the table. Puts the balance of 621. I'll bring up the table just to uh, confirm that one. Confirmation of that then, Ricky going through with Thunderkick, 177x from Wild Heist at Peacock Manor, that was a really nice one, uh, Melissa, 
yeah, you had your work cut out there against that one, I'm afraid. But um, 50x is not bad at all. But it is Ricky that goes through to the final. Next, we have got Ryan with Big Time Gaming against Dean and Playing Go. In on Little Devil for Big Time Gaming. This is for Ryan. It's on a 60p stake. We're going to be my angel. Let's pray for a good symbol for you. Okay, you've got nines. We've got nines. You can see it peppering nines everywhere. Oh dear. <laughs> Where's all the nines? Three spins to find a lot more nines. One more. I dearly need one on two. Wow. Right, last spin. Yeah, that didn't go great, did it? Unfortunately, it's gone for £6.84. Which, when rounded down, is 11x. Yeah, not the best, unfortunately. Okay, right, we're going to move on to play and go now. This is for Dean to see whether it can beat 11x. Okay, guys, this is Frozen Gems for play and go. And for Dean, we've got nine free spins. Here we go. Got to beat 11x from Little Devil. You'd like to think it wouldn't be too hard. You never know. Okay, you've just beat it. First spin. Okay, that's a big win. 17.22 off the first spin. be nice as well another big win another 22 quid six spins to go that an extra spin for this scatter yeah it was Another spin. Need some wins. All right, last chance. Okay, it's not the last chance. This is the last chance. Oh, that multiplier's up so high now. Look, we've got one more spin. <laughs> Nothing. It's a nice bonus though. Forty-six eighty. On a 60p stake. A quick look at that semi-final. Big time gaming. Yeah, Little Devil didn't do it. Even though we've got nines. 11x. So, uh, Dean Winchester and playing Goat. Courtesy of Frozen Gems. is going through to the final. The final lineup is Ricky Morley with Thunderkick. And Dean Winchester with playing Go. So, one of you is going to be the £50 winner for this one. We're uh, going to hit up a Thunderkick and see what we can do. Okay then, we're in for Thunder Kick. Hasn't took too long at all. This is Beat the Beast, Griffin's Gold. 10 free spins on a 50p state, this one. Here we go. This is for Ricky. We need to see more of them wilds landing and actually hitting. Need him to hit for it to go up. There we go. Seems like there's a times two now. An extra spin as well each time it does hit. I dearly need it to stay over this left side. I need it to bring it, bring its mate along. OK, 
Okay. Well, that's nice. Just need them to stick together, which they haven't done. Let's push that one up at times three. That's it, jump together. Bonus up a sixteen pound. Stay together. Come on, jump together now. Okay, that's nice. Nice symbol up here somewhere. Yeah, that should be nice. Yeah, that's very nice indeed. £58.75 pushes the bonus up to £78. Another spin. There's another big one. Wow, this game can go right off. Another 26, 25. Oh, none of them hit there. That's got to hit, isn't it? Surely. That's it. Okay, another £8.75 there. Yeah, nice position. Come on, nice symbol up here. Okay, it's only hit aces. Up to £119 though. Come on, just jump together one last time. No, we don't want that one going over there. Is that as high as they can get times five? It is, isn't it? They don't go up any more, any more than that. Mm, they've drifted away. Need them to come back to the left. <laughs> I think that's going to be bonus over. They've had enough. Yep. Right, that's a lovely bonus though. 134 pound. 134. I don't know what it went for in total. 134 pound 75 on a 50p. Okay, um, we move on. To it's play and go, isn't it? Play and go to see whether it can beat that. Final bonus of the tournament Rise of Athena for play and go. It's got to beat 269x. Um, this is for Dean. Yeah, it's got a long, uh, it's got a big way to go to uh, beat 269x, but you never know. I hope it does for my balance, anyway. Loads of these worlds to land. Okay, that's nice. It's a big win. Thirty-two forty. All right, they're going to stay there now and change the times twos. Three to go. Okay, it's flying in with the wilds now. Got one spin left. Okay, that's a big win. It's not going to be enough though, unfortunately. Another fourteen forty. That has gone for fifty-seven pound thirty-six. 57.36 on a 60p stake. There we have it. The final is complete. Um, Ricky Morley coming out on top with Thunderkick 269x. Um, unlucky Dean there. 
95x not a bad result but yeah it was a big ask to beat 269x thunder kick the out uh, the outstanding performers through this one really 78x in the first round 177x in the semi-final then 269x in the final so ricky if you want to uh, comment on the video send me an email um, the link to the website is in the description you'll find the email on there it is at the bottom of the home page i believe so um yeah if you want to do that i'll get that 50 quid over to you mate um the balance 777 so i'm up 277 quid from that which makes a change from the tournament videos i normally take a loss on these tournament ones but yeah that was nice there were some nice hits there at the end which obviously helped out um but yeah hope you all enjoyed it like i say it will be the last uh tournament video at least before christmas i may get another one out but yeah like i said i want to spend some time with the family over christmas so it may be the last one so if it is just want to wish everyone a merry christmas um hope you all enjoy yourselves hope you'll stay safe and uh abide by the rules we got to this christmas unfortunately it's the way it is this year but yeah i'm sure we'll get through it but um yeah have a good one everyone take care and i will see you very soon